welcome to this video. In this video I would like to pick and gut this uh, Wilka. It has a very nasty kiwi as you can see. And beside of this challenge, also the bidding is quite, uh, yeah, quite interesting. We have a very long key pin at uh, number 4, protecting 5 and 6. And yeah, I have to struggle with the bidding and with the keyway. So let me zoom in a little bit to give you a better view. And I have also installed a little lamp so that you can see uh, better what's going on inside. So we can see the, uh, the pins, sorry, you can see the pins um, protected by this ledge. And there is another ledge here. And yeah, you have to basically go in at an angle like so and turn around the pick in order to uh, access the pins and to push them down. You could possibly, let me show you, you could possibly use the holes in the right ledge um, directly from the top, but you would need to have a very uh, deep hook because uh, you would need to um, yeah, go in, go the, the full distance from here to there. So that, yeah, the, the hook would need to be uh, that deep. Okay, I will I will try to to use this uh, turning technique, um, and then we will see how how good it goes. So let me install the tension wrench like this. It gives me nice control to the plug. Maybe I can still zoom in a little bit more, like so. All right, light tension. I have to turn it a bit more. And I first used the uh, shallow hook from Sparrows to uh, pick the high pins. Then I will change uh, picks to, to a deeper hook. Alright, so this is take number four. <laughs> Uh, yeah, light tension, and I start with a shallow hook from Sparrows, all the way to the back. And I just slipped away from the pin. Now oh, that was a good click from six. I think that was one. So that's. I think that's all I can do with the with the shallow hook. I change picks to to a deep hook from from sparrows. I really played a lot with this lock uh, to get it mastered, but I just can pick it, and it opens. But I cannot tell the binding order. I cannot. Uh, pick it uh, reliably so this is still uh, <laughs> still a challenge for me this look sometimes sometimes it gives a false set sometimes not and I think that the, that the precision in this lock is really good so this lock has all the uh, properties of a of a great lock. It's six pins. Has a nasty keyway. Uh, a great bidding and very tight tolerances. Okay, that was one, and I felt a tiny little turn on the plug. I really love this Wilka. But it's doable, so sometimes I get it open. <laughs> Maybe not on camera.
and it gives not so much feedback. You can only tell which which pins are down, but maybe those pins also need to be pushed all the way to the shear line. So it's really hard to tell. I'm basically yeah, testing every pin when going from 1 to 6 and 6 to 1. Trying to, to turn the, the pick. Ah, okay. Now we got a four set. Really nice four set, as you can see. All right. And now I need to find the, the spool. Here's the spool. Hope we get it picked. Not sure what's the problem. If I cannot really good access the pin. Try to help the plug rotating manually. I think I use a different pick. I use that one, it's a little bit more pointy. Hope you can see that. Picking this, these balls is not the easiest in the world. I'm on the spool, but doesn't want to be set. And I fear that I reset everything. If I release, release tension one. No, I did not. It's open. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. So nasty little Wilka. You're open. Okay. I remove the lamp. Here's the lamp. It was just a holder for, for the lamp. So now let's cut it. All right. What about the focus? Yeah. And as this lock is such a nasty lock, I prepared the black pinning board. Haha. <laughs> All right, follower. Uh, turn it like like so. As I already removed the the ring, there is there is there was a ring, so no no clip. I have to uh, get it off with a saw, and uh, added this uh, spring steel clip that I can hopefully now remove without any problems. It's off. All right, so. I'm really curious to see the pins. Okay. So let's see. One and two came out at the same time. So I guess this is two. Uh, oh. Wow. They have serrated uh, key pins, crate pins. Look at that, that's a, a stock lock. Great, really, really nice. Okay, now I'm really curious to see the, the drivers. Standard, standard, oh, that's boring, oh, nice spool, not a nice spool, 
standard and standard. Dump the springs out. Wow! There's a lot of uh, uh, dust in it. Ah, that's the uh, that's from from filing or from from sawing the um, the ring off. So these particles are are the dust from from the ring. No wear no wear out from from the lock. All right. Uh, Hold on a second, I will uh, clean up this uh, mess and then <laughs> I'll be back with a, a nicer view. So here I'm back, I cleaned up the mess and we got a nice view to the pins. Um, they look, uh, yeah, they could be steel but they aren't, I checked it with a magnet, so they are most probably um, brass pins with a coating. Very nice, Very look very well made. The uh, key pins are serrated, the longer ones have more serrations and the drivers are standard beside of 3 and 4. I doubt that 4 actually uh, plays a role in in, uh, in picking because the key pin is so long so probably uh, this spool is not effective but we will check it just in a moment. and. This, I think, was the, the only spool that sometimes uh, plays a role in, in picking. Yeah, very nice pins. And let's have a look at the plug. Yeah, everything's round, very nice. Also looks uh, very well made. Get this out of the way. Ah, we can check uh, number four. Oh, it is effective, although the, the key pin is so long. So, we could have uh, two spools to pick, but we were lucky, only one spool uh, were effective in, the, in this picking uh, attempt. So, let's have a look inside. Uh, we can do that with the lamp very well. Just need to adjust the focus to manual focus. Get this out of the way. So here we've got a nice view to the inside of the plug. You can see the the latches. You can see the the holes where the pins go in. Yeah, and if you if you pick, you need to go in at an angle like like so, and then turn around around this around this uh, ledge here. I, I will um, add some uh, pictures at the end, so we can then have a look at it uh, very close. All right, that was. Uh, Picking and gutting of the evil worker. Six pin lock. Thank you very much for watching and happy picking. Bye bye.